is about to begin. And you're gonna love it. What's up, YouTube? It's Galaxirax Topher bringing you my first installment of my online Dynasty Pac 12 Follow Me Season Majigger. Uh, I'm gonna do kind of like a play by play thing. Uh, let me know if you like it. I think it's going to be, I don't, know, I don't know how well I'm going to do. Right now I'm going over, you can see, predicted last in the Pac-12 North, predicted last in the Pac-12. No All-American, or All-Americans or All-Pac-12 first or second teamers. So I'm definitely bottom of the barrel, so it should be an interesting season. Um, obviously not much hope for me. Predicted last, no All-Americans or All-Pac-10 players. It means I don't got anyone that is going to make some noise. But I, I disagree with that. I, I believe... My corner, who you'll see here in a little bit, Dion, uh, uh, Dion Buchanan, number 20. I think he'll do really well this year. Also, obviously, Tool, my quarterback. Mm, the only reason I can, I guess, p understand why he didn't make uh, all Pac-12 is just because uh, Andrew Luck and all the other great quarterbacks. But here we go, opening kickoff. My kick returner, Air, takes it. Hits the outside to the left and takes it 81 yards. Opening play of the season. Obviously not a lot of fans there in Pullman to uh, watch the game, but that's definitely the way you want to kick off your season. This is, on the other hand, is not. After the ensuing kickoff, they, on their first play, get a huge run play. Luckily, I get three good stops and then obviously the sack, and I have to force a field goal. They make it. Now, I promise you, this is not a mirrored image of what you just saw. Here's my cornerback, kick returner, number or number nine, air. Taking it back, kicks it out to the left again. All the players in almost the same spot. Takes another kick return back to the house. The fans in Martin Stadium loving it. Wish more people would have came out to see it. Then for Idaho State, it was a off game. All, all game. Uh, right here, they get a approachment to help get them from fourth and second to first and ten but it doesn't matter because my linebacker whizzle comes up with it uh mizzle my bad uh comes up with the pick takes it back uh then mitts gets a nice run out of nothing takes it up the middle after bouncing off some guys big run out of a not too great uh running back then it sets up this play right here jeff tool to the tight end, Stormo dives in, rolls in, rumbling, tumbling, tight end for the second TD, third TD of this game. Then here we go, Whizzle or Mizzle, my linebacker comes up with it again, off the fumble by the quarterback, big plays. Uh, then Tool rolls out again, he has o open in the end zone, just can't turn around and launch it fast enough, gets sacked, and that is the end of the first quarter, Wazoo's up 21 Three, not looking good for the Idaho State Bengals. All right, first play of the second quarter. Tool rolls back, hits Wilson, his star wide out over the middle, takes it up. Pretty good play. Then next play, throws it, hits card setter on the deep curl in the corner of the end zone. Nice play by the senior out of Spokane. Then obviously another pick, another not a replay of earlier. Whizzle hits it again. This man is just on fire. He's got a fumble recovery and two interceptions. Then I hit Stormo over the middle. He rumbles and tumbles forward. I'm liking this tight end. He's he's a beast. And then Tool decides to not go on the outside with the option. Cut it back in. Take it in for the easy six. Nice little stop there. Trying to get their offense going. Then, ooh, misses his wide open guy over the middle. That was a touchdown, if not just tons of yards. Tool rolls back. Hits Wilson on what looked like the corner over jumped the route. Then Mitz takes this nice run for 10 yards. Then Tool rolls back. He's got Mitz, or, uh, Mitz open on the screen. Nice little deflection, nice little block. Just can't break it. Uh, then on this very next play, he hits Barton, who rolls, tumbles, falls in the end zone for another six. Washington State absolutely destroying this Idaho State team. Uh, and that's the end of the second half. Uh... 42-3, to Wazoo, Butch, T. Cougar having some fun. The fans in Martin Stadium that are there, loving it. Uh, looks like it's a great first half. Hopefully, they continue, continue the success in the second, and they do, leading off with a sack, and then another sack. And that's their fourth sack of the game. Not a lot of hurries or knockdowns, but you know the quarterback's still feeling those four sacks. 
And then we get the ball back. Tools looking for X on the out route, but sees card setter open deep, throws it, scores, and this is where Coach Laxrock Sofer decides, eh, I've beat them up enough with my offense, putting in the second team. Then uh, Idaho State finally cuts a break, hits the wide out, gets nice yardage on that, almost in the field goal range. Then they get a couple nice plays to set up this field goal. Puts them down 48 or 49 to 6. Winston, the backup running back, making some noise. Obviously, two clocks on. Quarter goes by fast. Wazoo up 49 to 6 against Idaho State. Looking good. Don't expect much out of Idaho State in the fourth quarter. Both teams starting to play their uh, second teamers, but not quite yet. Deion Buchanan, the player to look out for in the intro. Comes up with this nice pick six, and this is when Laxrox Topher goes, Oh, it's time for my second stream defense to come in, too. Now, here's Loban Stahl, the backup quarterback. He's trying to make something happen out of nothing and ends up making something happen for the other team. But we get a fumble, but it doesn't matter because they pick up the ball. Idaho State getting some steam. Too little, too late, maybe. I think so, but maybe not. Quarterback hits up the middle with just over two minutes left. Looking really bad for Idaho State. Not going to pull it out. And this sack definitely doesn't help them at all. Idaho State rolls back again. Another sack. Just their O-line gave up six sacks in this game. It's kind of hard. That one looked like it hurt. you got to protect your quarterback if you want some wins. Uh, hands it off to Winston, the backup running back again. He takes it 50-plus yards for a touchdown. Probably should have dive, dove to run out the clock more, but oh well. They don't do anything with it. Clock runs out. Washington State wins their season opener against Idaho State 63-6, to with most of the first teamers being out early in the second half. A uh, great way to open the season for Wazoo. Coach Laxrock Sofer's got to be excited, but they got the running Rebels coming up next week, and uh, going to look forward to that game. It's a back-to-back -back homestand, and let's see what the Cougars can do against the running Rebels. That video should be up soon, but until then, comment, rate, subscribe for more. This has been Lax Rock Stouffer reminding you, keep gaming.